NHRA <clears throat> Speed for All. Uh, tonight we're gonna do uh, we're gonna finish a uh, pro uh, the first uh, pro stock career mode uh, season. As you can see, we like bubblegum. The cars won uh, a Wally already. I think I have two Wallies this season. Uh, we, uh, we have the car running well. Okay, there you go. <clears throat> so we won one. New England and the other one we won at Tucson but we didn't qualify it either one of these finals at the uh, uh, lost in the finals at uh, Indy no qualifying there so we're gonna start off at Summit we'll leave the car pink and uh, let's go get it I believe we're gonna be sitting. Just make sure, make sure we have everything. Hey, what's happening, race? We're uh, we're just checking everything out right now, getting ready to uh, go pick up where we left off. I haven't played the game all day, so we're coming in just the way we finished last night. But I think we're gonna do an off the trailer event here, real quick. See how the car runs. Hope you're doing well. I like to try to get the car to run over 200 miles an hour consistently now. Go ahead and make a test pass and just see what happens. Yep, that's uh if you got if you have nothing to do, this is the place to be. So uh <clears throat> and I'll tell you what, I'm I'm really liking the color of this car. Hey, check this out. Look where we're at in this test run. In case this is the left lane. The racetrack this weekend. My name's Brian Loans, and I'll be your host for the race. It's always a treat to call the events, and hope you're having as much fun as I am. <laughs> or I just throw one down. moving six eighty eight one ninety nine okay so we we didn't break into the two hundred right off the bat but we sure did come close yeah no it's uh 
another sensational races in the books and we've got we should be come, able so to pick these lanes that's drag racing man I, it just being a one lane pony is uh it hasn't been that fun we've never watched a real preview from the left lane this view ah that is a uh, that's another classic let's go back to the start okay. the driver in the left lane came off the starting line quicker which gave them the advantage that they needed So we have a car again. The little adjustment we we made the last couple races uh, seemed to help. You know what? You might uh, might be right. Let's go and uh, we'll, we'll call this the YouTube tune. Sunday night, we're just throwing whatever we want at it. We're not winning a championship this season. We have, you know, I think, four or five races left. So let's just try to make her go fast. I want to. I wanted to go over 250. I don't know who ran 215. I saw you put up 215, uh, that would, uh... Be nice to run somewhere about... <clears throat> we'll start at 200 first. Okay. What a beautiful day for drag racing. Couldn't have asked for anything better, and I don't know about you, but I think the competition is going to be just as good as the weather. Yeah. Uh... Okay, here, look at this little bug that just showed up. You see this? You notice what's different? This guy's little menu didn't... is stuck to my screen. It never cleared. Uh... Yeah, no, I'm wondering, I, I'm just not, uh, I just loaded the game. Okay, so. See? If I have to make a run looking at that guy, I'm going to be pissed because I'm going to have to reload the game and shut down the stream Sunday night.
Yeah, it doesn't appear to be. I'm finding it when the next time he talks, if his new one doesn't won't reset, I don't know. In case this is your first time out to the racetrack this weekend, my name's Brian Lowe, and I'm your host of racing. It's always a treat to be hey. events, and hope you're having as much fun as I am. That's bullshit, but, uh... Let's we'll see. This is a treat, ladies and gentlemen. You know what? You might be right. Because we started the game finally getting a left lane run, and then all of a sudden his little icon. Yeah, you might be right. 684. Look at that. 199.78. We ran a 77 in testing. We want to break 200 tonight and just consistently run 200. Good light. But um, it'll be hard to top that last race, but I am certain the drivers in the next round will leave it all on the track. We've got more NHRA drag racing action. Come. See, yeah, see, he's going to follow us. He's not clearing off my screen. Maybe after we finish the race, it'll clear. I don't know. Just another little chink in the armor of this game. Okay, so where are we set? I didn't even. Greg Anderson's in points there. He's killing it. Okay, so we're sitting in we're at number we're number six but we're gonna still run a qualifying run get used to the Psycon or whatever you want to call this guy's bug sitting there stuck on my screen and I apologize I probably I, I don't know who is he supposed to be somebody we're supposed to know or I'm in case you're looking to go on a road trip, the NHRA has over 140 on. sanctioned drag strips across America. I short shifted down early. Okay, six eighty four. Still on the warp. On the race. One ninety eight. Wow, that was something special, wasn't it? Two of the NHRA's brightest stars head to head in this. dropped to 11. Look at that. We ran the same ET with the same tune-up. That's consistency right there. It's 684-2, 684-2. Wow. 
I know. It just... And I was, uh, I was moving the car around there, so it, it, it probably was a little quicker. Just lucky we ended up there. tell you what I hope this guy isn't here to party with us the whole night on the screen he hasn't left he's been stuck there we're having to race around him let's go see what this will do what a pleasure it is to call this event in front of our royal nature no better fans yeah uh, right now we have four people in here so it's like So we went the wrong way with that. What a race. Their dragsters will go back to the pits. The engines will be rebuilt. And then it's time to do it all over again in the next round. Oh, my. And then look at that. We run a 684-2, 684-2, 684-1. That's something. That's being consistent. Okay, now we got to get in the field. What happened to us last night at the last race? I want to give a big thanks to all the staff and volunteers here at the racetrack to make events like these possible. I think we were side by side right there. We'll see you next time. Look at that, a whole shot win. Oh my. A 684 beating a 670. 
Wow, 057 light. And we still have that 199. Yeah. Something. An exceptional race for these two drivers. I think we were side by side. Next phase of this race weekend. I think this race is so much closer than we had some close ones last night, but we'll have to see how this one turns out. Oh, this idiot here, he wants to tell you something. We we interrupt this broadcast for maybe this is one of the game reps watching the stream. Right lane driver makes a strong getaway off the line, and that was all she wrote. Yeah. Hey, he just disappeared. Let's hopefully he's gone for good. Yeah. So we had 684 covered, no matter what we tried, gearing wise, little changes. We just made it go better just by a tick. So, uh, that's pretty consistent, though. Onward. Let's hopefully he, he reboots himself off the game. Or off my screen. He was a handicap. Okay. Good, he's gone. I like bubblegum. When Wally's with this, this is a uh, subscriber uh, design. I was very unsure of it at the beginning, but kind of wears on you. Now we'll uh, see what we have here. Yeah, it does. I like it. I like it. I was very unsure of it last night. We had two different versions of it. This one I really like. And now we need... Uh, that's the car running. It runs good. It's just not quite perfect. It's idling, it sounds okay. It's just that sewing machine, air dryer sound. There's 200 mile an hour run right there. 671, 200 miles an hour. 
onward to the next race. this funny car going yeah well now we'll uh we'll see what we have left try to run out the uh we're right here Texas Carolina Maple Grove Vegas and then Pomona. We're gonna win. Well, let's try to win three out of five. We'll just hunker down and let's go. That was a solid pass right there. Let's just hope, hopefully it transfers to this track. That's the only if. I don't have a book of tunes for the pro stock, so. The pro mod, I have I have so many gear sets for that thing. Okay. Oh, well, we made it to 200, so... I think 671, even though in testing, is one of my best uh, ETs stock, so. What a great, what a great turnout, turnout we've seen so, so far, far for this weekend's, weekend's event. event. The, the grandstands, grandstands are filling up, up and we're just about ready to rock and roll. So without further ado, let's take it. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. It's busy in the grandstand, it's busy down on the midway, and we're all looking forward to another sensational drag racing event. It's sure to be one of the most side by side racing right there most competitive class yet six eighty six one ninety eight to a six ninety three okay wasn't the perfect run Stay didn't feel North like it NHRA championship drag racing action powered by camping world with this number seven Yeah, they're right there. If I had the balls, I could swing a camera look over there. I'll try to get that. But when if I do stuff like that, I just throw it into the wall. That's a big mess. Safety Safari comes out. They have to clean up the track. It's no fun. So uh, let's go like this. Oh, it's so nice having them off my screen. The Wally is what these drivers are all fighting on the track for. Introduced in 1969, the Wally trophies are 18 inches tall. They're 12 pounds, 18 plastic. Look, 
cockeyed. If you thought the last round was exciting, you ain't seen nothing yet. A solid run, but they won't be breaking any records with that performance. Ooh. Albeit, they still came out on top. Oh, we beat them. Oh, look at that. Boys and girls, we just hopped that up a little bit. Just that little tickle just did that. 669, 202. We wanted to be in the 200s. It hasn't taken us long to get there. Now, if we can keep it there, we're going to be what tough to race. beat. Their dragsters will go back to the pits, the engines will be rebuilt, and then it's time to do it all over again in the next round. Okay. Number six. We're going to leave it right there for the afternoon session and night session. Okay, here we go. Got five of us in here. Welcome, everybody. Hope, hopefully, you're enjoying these broadcasts. Like and subscribe. We're going rounds tonight. Sunday night edition of NHRA Speed Pro. Yeah, he. Yeah, he was moving. It sounded like. That's why I wanted to, you know, yeah, it uh, said something about me getting to 200. Well, we're here now, so. See, and that would be nice to, to where if we could have a multiplayer where we can race each other. Uh, you know, you could settle grudge racing. It's just, it, it's amazing how uh, we're missing a huge part. They could be killing it with the multiplayer on this game. So. You'd have more people on here than you'd know what to do with. Anyways, let's uh, continue on with qualifying. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. It's busy in the grandstands. It's busy down on the midway. And we're all looking forward to another sensational drag racing event. It's sure to be one of the most intense competitions of this year's calendar. Oh. Seems to be happening quite, quite free, frequently here. That's a, that's something. Oh, it's gonna hold me there. It's not gonna let me make the run. Nah, no, it's not gonna let me make the run. It's got me stopped. Yeah, I can't move forward. It, Oh, look at our timer stop the 34 seconds. So, I don't know if we're suspended in time or what, but... Hey, mister, can you, uh... There you go. Thank you there, buddy. We gotta give him a name. Jeez. Look at that. Perfect light, perfect run all the way around. At least they didn't bump me out of the field. We sit number 10. Okay, I was really curious. And look at that. Look at how much my car goes down. I didn't do a burnout. The AI just decides not to do maintenance on his car and he blows it up on a burnout. And I'm penalized for his, you know, look at this. Spending money I didn't have to. Let's go get him, though. 
love to see all of our young NHRA fans in the audience. Don't forget, kids, we've got junior dragster racing in every sanctioned NHRA dragster. Kids from the age of 5 to 17 can get their drag racing career started. Oh, it's again, again. We got nice action two in a row. Oh, shoot. He takes it off. Let's try to do our burnout. I crossed the center what line. Crazy, right crazy right two rounds of qualifying here. We might as well get in the action when we start hearing that. We'll just go out and let's just throttle down and crash the car on the burnout with him. You know, we can't let him get all the glory on these qualifying. Two AI crashes in a row. We stay number 10. Oh, look at what it gave me. Check that out. It gave me a uh, 760 ET for qualifying three, and I never made a run. Somebody needs to check all the timers. The AI is going wild tonight. Bot drivers are having a hard time. All this streaming just gives me more footage for uh, for some uh, videos coming out. Okay, we like bubble gum. We haven't been able to make a qualifying run because they're crashing on the burnouts. So, had two in a row. We joined the action that time, crossed the center line just for fun. Let's get this round done. How bad was our car hurt? Look at that. This has been an expensive race and I haven't made a run. Engine's done with. Gearbox needs to be swapped. On behalf of the NHL, here we go. welcome to today's Camping World Drag Racing Series Championship event. I'm your host, Brian Lones, and I'll be yelling at you from up here in the commentary booth. And let me just say, I cannot wait to see these cars on the track. And we're going to watch and just see something. Just, let's see if we can't catch some. Exactly. How'd we do there? Okay. Run 680, 199. No tea time yet. Yeah, we gotta wait until he comes on. Ghetto prior. Okay, so she ran, or he ran uh, 698, 191. Okay. Great display by both drivers. You can tell that they put their heart and soul into every inch. It's a sheep. Welcome to today's Camping World Drag Racing Series Championship event. I'm your host, Brian Lowe, and I'll be yelling at you from up here at the commentary booth. And let me just say, I'm going to see these cars on the This feels like it could be the beginning of a famous rivalry. Fantastic showing from these two incredible drivers. 
Man, we're side by side all the way down the track. What a wild race right there. I bet you we're, we're door to door and we take it again. 685, 198, it was 706. Wasn't as close as it, I thought it was, but. It is such a they're always the around. Drivers can move forward after that performance. Let's see. Okay. Move forward they will. We've got more NHRA race action. Okay, Greg Anderson it is. I'm gonna leave the car right where it's at. Just bring it all up to snuff. took him out points leader and we did a 682 to a 697 okay we found the car is it the car to win Wally's we'll find out the skill these drivers have to hustle their dragsters down the strip it is hard to fathom. but we just took out Don't the points leader We've got more of it coming your way next and uh, there's nowhere to go but up Final round. Yeah, it's a, uh, we seem to have found the car with the little tweaks we've made. Once you're close, just tweak it a little. The Wally is what these drivers are all fighting on the track. Introduced in 1969, Wally trophies are 18 inches tall, and they're 12 pounds of anti-grass ball. It is Evo's number one. Let's do this. What a race we get it's been and it's all about to get better than the answer of the race. You can feel the heat from those engines all the way up here in the announcing booth. We've got a great new champion. Congratulations to them for a well-earned race win. We're winning Wally's boys. We're winning Wally's 685, 195. <clears throat> yeah. We lost a little mile an hour, but uh, I think there was a miss shift in there somewhere. That was a great race, wasn't it? It's tough it's having the two uh, ship lights coming on. Great race I need to just focus on one of them and cue on that. We're sitting number seven. This first season, I think they're gonna uh, will win the Rookie of the Year award. 
won a few races now, three races. Want to win three out of the last five. That might move us up. We do something like that, or if we run the table, that's where they'll put us. One round of it. And I think the loading screen, instead of having just the stock car there, they should have your car that you're racing with in career mode. You know, I like what you have. Anyways, just little things I, I notice. Okay, here we go. Where are we heading to? Z-Max, okay. I think we've done well there, to tell you the truth. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So, a Wally in the bag. First race of the night, we won a Wally. We've gone, uh, I think, 202 miles an hour. We were trying to get in the consistent 200 miles an hour seem to be right right around that range yeah well we'll have to see what uh i forgot what seth was saying he ran last night This class is so much more competitive than the first two. Seems like every race is close. Save the money. Car's running good. I'm Brian Loans, and I'll be your host for this weekend's NHRA Camping Road We need to put a bubblegum machine gun on this thing for our, our rides back down pit road. Down the return lane. Return road. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, let's go see where we're at. In case you're looking to go on a road trip, the NHRA has over 140 sanctioned drag strips across the earth. Yeah. Be a showman, you know? Until we took some kid's eye out with it, you know, and then, oops! Six seventy nine one ninety four. We have the ET. Wow, that was something special, wasn't it? Two of the NHRA's brightest stars head to head, and there's plenty more of that to come back. Okay, we're number seven. What I've learned is you don't have to be number one. Just make it get qualified, and they all seem to slow down for the eliminations a little. Welcome, new viewers. Okay. 
In case you were looking to go on a road trip, the NHRA has over 140 sanctioned drag strips across the country. See where this uh, let's see 686. Look at that perfect light. Don't like doing that. 197. We've lost our mile an hour here, but an exceptional race for these two drivers, and plenty of questions leading into the next phase of this race weekend. Okay, we're staying at number 12. Lots of little ET on that. Two afternoon and night session should be a lot better. If you're lucky this weekend, race fans, you can get a chance to run into some of your favorite drivers right down on the midway. Do not be shy. They love taking photos and giving on That was finger never touched the joystick to steer it. That just was stuck to the ground right in the groove. We run 676, 195. Yeah, they're gonna have wow, a tough that time. That was something special, wasn't it? Two of the NHRA's brightest stars head to head. Stay number 12 with that one. Okay, so we stay number 12. We'll just uh, see how it runs. Night. We'll uh, be off to eliminations. It's always, it's always such a thrill, such a thrill, to, thrill watch to watch these cars, cars, isn't it? Don't miss this one, folks. Kind of froze right there at the end. Let's 
686, 196. Okay. A real consistent There's car right here. Down, and if this competition stays this fierce moving forward, we are shaping up to... Okay, takes us down to 14th, which I don't mind. Like if they come back a little off their qualifying time, we're going to be right there on them. I just want a car that goes down the track every time the same way. Predictable. Have run 200 tonight. Be running more 200 miles an hour. This might not be here at this race. Want to win a Wally? Let's see. In case this is your first time out to the racetrack this weekend, my name's Brian Lowe's and I'm your host for the race. It's always a treat to call the events and hope you're having as much fun as I It's all about the Wally. I hope we took him out. It kind of did a little dicey move there. Okay, 680. 201. We are back in the 200s here. Okay. There was no way he was beating us. He was nowhere near close. My heart is still pounding after that last race run, and we've got more for you coming. Bubblegum car is just keeps moving forward, going rounds. Second round. The Wally is what these drivers are all fighting on the track for. Introduced in 1969, Wally trophies are 18 inches tall. They're 12 pounds of antique brass and ball cut. It is the most coveted prize for anglers. Didn't uh, should have beat him. Oh, there we go. 687, 201. We're back in the 200s. He ran a 703, or she did. Salute. They're, they all slowed down My a little. Heart is still pounding after that last Just race gotta get qualified. For you coming up next. Yeah, I, I'm not. And I'm not moving it until it falls off, or we have to change it. Yeah, it's really, uh, we got it, uh, running well. Okay. Let's do this. Okay, semifinals. Okay, we're going up against Sess girl. Take her out. The next event in the NHRA Camping World Drag Racing Championship Series is kicking off with a bang.
689 to a 706 okay 200 yeah we're we're covering 200 almost every run the last what three four runs drivers i don't know about you folks but i am still coming down from that one okay we've taken him out once tonight let's take him out again Should be fun, boys. In case you were wondering, yes, the Wally Trophy is named after the Matrix Auto Wall of Parts. It's a much popular figure around here. If the driver wants a wall, he'll take over. Another Wally for their mantle. <laughs> there we go. 687, 193. Lost a bunch of uh, mile an hour, but we break into tonight's stream, Sunday night's edition. Two Wallies in a row. Things are looking up. We wanted to win three out of five. We've won the first two. This has been the YouTube tune. Race here has thrown some suggestions in. The ghetto pirate, pirate who is not here tonight, he's given me some suggestions. So has Seth, the rest of them. Car's running good. See, I think the bubble gum should be sitting right there. And if you're racing pro stock, it should be a pro stock car. And it should be your car that you're racing. Just, just saying. Yeah, and I wonder how much... You know, they're, the sponsorships, you know, all these names being used, you know, what what's... They wouldn't want just a no-name. Okay, she's won two in a row. You know, you've heard of the men in black, now you got the men in pink. We're running hard. I guess you can run pink if you're winning races. Okay, so uh, let's see where we're gonna go. Welcome viewers. Okay, two in a row. Next, I think we're going to Maple Grove. Is it? Yeah, Maple Grove. I actually have run good here in the other classes, so let's get this. 
And you know, we did get a, a, a game trophy last night of uh, winning a Wally at every track in career mode. So I think it was called the American Legend trophy. So we did earn that last night. We've won quite a few Wallies. These are all the other seasons I've run to get to where we're at today. That season three of Super Modified was I had a really good car right there. And I actually think I'm going to go back and uh, just do a season where I just dominate. And I'd like to fill up all the cards. Uh, we'll see where we go with this game though. Love to see a patch or a download or something to fix some issues. I'd like to be able to pick my lane and run in the left lane because sometimes you have to run in the left lane. Can't just be a one lane pony. But we're dealing with it and we're winning races so let's go. Yeah, just start at the bottom and more people. And then, you know, what I hate to see is these guys we keep making games. And they're like every two years you come out with a new drag racing game. And not just keep the same game, just keep... I'd buy content if, if it improves the game. You know, once a year, 30, 40 bucks once a year. In, in, in a good patch or something, you know, and uh, build a true drag racing sim. Okay, here we are. I feel no need to do a test pass. Car's running good. And I kind of like qualifying down in the, uh, in the cellar. Because when they what slow down during eliminations, so we just we night. start picking the off the leaders. Oh, Fernando! This is it, ladies and gentlemen. It's busy in the grandstands. It's busy down on the midway, and we're all looking forward to a sensational drag racing event. It's sure to be one of the most intense competitions. That was a four speed right there. We're back to the uh I bet you we could kill him with four gears. We'll kill our mile an hour. No twenty two. Whole shot win. Look at that. Look at that. We beat a six eighty eight. Six ninety eight. He had a he had us covered. Okay. This is what we love to see. Two gritty, hard nosed racers putting everything they have into their dragsters. Okay, we're in 10th. Oh, the tune up seems to be working. Let's just see where we go. That wasn't a perfect run by any means. I missed that shift and I carry fourth gear too deep. What a pleasure it is to call this event in front of our loyal NHRA fans. No better fans in the world than the NHRA track racing fans. All righty, here we go. Both of these 
<laughs> Sorry. 683, 180. <laughs> that was a. Uh... Ouch, we haven't done anything. <laughs> Insult to injury right there. We haven't done anything like that. We took him out. Okay, let's. That was something. They should let us see that. Yeah, that, uh... Okay. Okay. So, look at this. So I run a... First round, I run a 698.8. Okay. Shouldn't I be up here in the qualifying for that first qualifying run? That guy there just ran a 698.0. They were they put me down at the bottom. They took away my first run for crashing the car on the second run. Is kind of what it looks like. I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something, but that doesn't seem right. I think my first run's my first run. Had a crash DQ in the second run. Now we're going to the third. Yeah, it, it, it's it's. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna go blue screen. I'm gonna clip this. Yeah, that's kind of funny how that happened. I, I think I should I wouldn't be qualified but I should be up in, up in here I should be right behind him at 18 for the game's broke but we have to deal with it it's all we have I just know not to red light on a really good qualifying run. Okay. Because you won't get it. If you're lucky this weekend, race fans, you can get a chance to run into some of your favorite drivers right down on the midway. Do not be shy. They love taking the photos and getting on. I'm going to have to come up with a gear set for this track. We... There he is. Tea and crumpets to you, my friend. Good morning. Two wallies in a row this morning for you. Actually, be this evening for me. Are those tires going to be warm enough to get the traction they need off the line? Here we go. Let's do this. Both of the drivers made it through the first round, but it's not going to be the easiest from here. Yeah, okay, that's it. Ooh, that sounds good. 695, look at that, we cut a perfect light. Don't like doing that. I don't think I've red lit, I shouldn't be saying that, but I don't think I've red lit at all this, this season in Pro Stock. So another whole shot win. We have quite a few of those. We like uh, exciting racing this wow, pro stock. Was something special, wasn't it? Two of the NHRA's brightest stars head to head, and there's plenty more of that to come next.
let's just see how close it was. AM can't wait to get on and see Alki run this car. Where are these guys? They should be coming through here. Here they come. It's a replay at the start. No, we had the him right by a fender. Makes a strong getaway off the line, and that was all she wrote. Though, so, and we didn't qualify. Doesn't matter. We're we're looking at runs like 695. So what do we have to do to qualify? 683. I don't know if I can find that much. One. That's just going sideways. Let's see. <laughs> well, shit. I'm an hour 20 into it, so I woke you up nice and early. I'm sorry, my friend. I can see you have those notifications turned on. That's a good thing. Like and subscribe if you haven't. It's been a few of you guys just sitting in here watching me play. I appreciate all the t watch time. Uh, if you're not into the chatting thing, give it a try. These guys won't bite. They set a chat record two nights ago of a 589 chats in three hours. They tried to beat it last night. They fell short, but you know, they gave it a, we went four hours in, we went four hours deep last night. So, uh, the other night was special. You guys set a really high watermark with the chatting. Bench racing at its finest. <laughs> no, it's a beautiful thing because it's you guys are like my crew guys. You got you guys come in in stages, and uh, that's uh, that's perfect. And then by the end of the night, you're all in here, and we're having a good time. Okay, cool. Okay, so we ran a 684, 199. I don't know if we made it in the oh, field. I think, I'm losing my voice. What a race we just saw. I think we, we had to run 683. We're just going to be on the outside. Yeah, it ended up being a 681, but we did step it up. Just not enough. Okay, the Wally streak is broke. So we gotta get back on it. Get back on it and uh So I think we go to Vegas now. 
Vegas and then Pomona. Okay, so now we're looking at... Vegas, Pomona. And we sit... Seventh in the standings. I think that's worth, especially if we get in the thousand points, which we should do. We should earn the uh, rookie of the rookie of the year award for Wally so far. I think we have a, a car to uh, actually quite go quite deep next season. Let's see here. And look at here, ghetto. The funny car is being built up. So by the end of next season, it should be ready to go. No worries, my friend. That's uh There'll be plenty of in car funny car videos and in car funny car passes coming up here soon. I like the in-car look. And the bubblegum car is Won two Wallies tonight, first two races. We didn't qualify at the third. Let's see how we do here. Right there at my door. So six eighty eight. Exceptional race for these two drivers, and plenty of questions leading into the next phase of this race weekend. Puts us right about number seven. That's where we've been qual. Oh, our first runs have been putting us. We'll drop down, I'm guessing, somewhere about 14, 15.
drag racing fans, welcome to the NHRA Amateur Championship. We have more class drivers than some of the most powerful engines on Earth, and myself, Brian Lowe. that fourth gear out a little too long. Six eighty seven, one eighty five. Yeah, when I hang on to that fourth gear it, it kills a mile an hour. But it almost goes quicker. These drivers, that's why they're at the top of the sport. The finals are still to come, so stick around. Anticipation for our next race coming up here in the commentary box, ladies and gentlemen. The roar of the engines firing up, the smell of the exhaust, the sun. Plan. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm I'm trying to build Okay, 683 200 miles an hour, okay, Ooh, that was a close race She was laying on the line would have been a lot closer Wow, that was something special wasn't it? Two of the NHRA's brightest stars I still have to get head through head pro stock to We're gonna win the championship next season We're, uh, we're struggling at the moment. 683, it's the quickest we've run. 676. Stock's not my, one of my favorites, so I'm trying not to put all the time into that. Pro Mod, I'll go back to Pro Mod. And I'm going to love Funny Car and Top Fuel, I know that. Thanks, actually. 
We crowd some well-deserving new winners. The big question is, will they be able to defend their win the next time the NHRA comes to town? Ah, uh, I don't think I qualify, guys. Jeez. 685, no, 201. Okay. It'll be hard to top that last race, but I am certain the drivers of the next round will leave it all on the track. We've got more NHRA drag racing action coming up. Oh, perfect. Great, Jeno, that's good. And you're one of the furthest ones away from my mic, so if it sounds good on your end, it sounds good, I think, probably for everybody else. <clears throat> okay, 21st. We're still in 7th. A DNQ. We're going to have those this first season. Still getting the tune-up figured out. I think we have to at least get a tenth off the car here soon. Start qualifying in the upper half of the field. <laughs> really? Okay. That's funny. Well, I'm still new to all this, so I'm hoping as we go along this journey, I'm gonna, I'll get better at it. Some nights I'll sound good. Some nights I'll sound tired. But I'm enjoying it. I'm glad I'm meeting new friends. <clears throat> you guys seem to be liking it. Come, keep coming by every night. So just remember tomorrow and uh, Monday I'll be off. I'll be back on Tuesday. And we'll go Tuesday through Saturday. Thank you, Race. Yeah, I, uh, I, uh, yeah, it's one of those things. I think I saw I had not a lot of viewers on there. I, I've got a couple guys that have subscribed through Fortnite, and they're hanging on. Uh, but I never really uh, streamed a lot of Fortnite. I, I like to do it on the weekends. Yeah, I think you said you told me that. I got suckered in early, and uh, I just have too much time invested. I don't spend any money on that game, but uh, very little. I buy battle passes. But I have... Uh, I've met some good, good guys over there, too. Actually, one of them... Uh, I got a, a guy who... Uh, I play Fortnite with. He's not. He's been watching my drag racing uh, streams, and uh, I think I'm gonna. We're, we might do a meet and greet here, here, at, probably at Pomona or something like that. Get some nitro newbies in here. Yeah, I like that kind of multiplayer. I, I've gotten... Uh, at my age, it, it, it's taken me to learn everything you have to know and how to do. It just, it just seems like wa not playing that game. It, I'm a, getting halfway decent at it. And It took me 3,000 games in solos in Fortnite. It took me 3,000 games to finally win my first Victory Royale. But I had like, out of those 3,000 games, I had like 600 seconds. 
and uh, just crazy. And then once I win the first one, it's all downhill. I've, I'm, I have like 45 victory royales, but I have playing duos with with my uh, played a lot of duos. Okay, yeah. Well, that's perfect. I need a break. I've gone pretty much non-stop on this game for a couple weeks. So, uh, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to make some videos. I have a lot of video clips. So... I can feel the anticipation for our next race coming up. Let's get this done. Ladies and gentlemen, the war of the engines firing up, the smell of the exhaust, the sun flipping off the engines. Whole shot win six eighty three. One ninety to one ninety one. Oh, I think I'm losing my voice. What a race we just saw. And we've got more NHR. Not ninth. I have a decent car, it just gotta step it up just a little. Sounded like he was hit bouncing off the walls. He's gonna run it. Let's do this. I thought he was gonna have a burnout crash party. I was gonna join him. Okay, yeah, he was bouncing off the wall. 704, 678, 195. Okay, we just dipped down. This is what we love to see. Two gritty, hard nosed racers putting everything they have. We stay number 10 with that. And I think with the weather. Weather's gonna come right to the tune up now. As I hope. Did you miss us? That's right, folks. It's the start of another NHRA typical drag racing event. And we're so happy to have you here to take any action.
lane, smoke the tires. it back and forth in the lane like that. Oh, look at that. 670. 200 miles an hour. Okay. So that little just tweak in third gear just brought us right back. The NHRA Camping World Drag Racing Series never fails to deliver hard pounding high octane action. And we stay number 11. The field's going like crazy, 646. We just want to hang in here, just get qualified. Okay, so we got a bunch of work to do here for some of these races. I didn't play the game all day today. We just picked up right where we left off last night. Bubblegum is the theme. We like bubble gum. Car looks good. Maintenance crew has been working very hard to sweep and spray the track in preparation for this event. They do good work. We still won. <laughs> we were all over that lane at the top end. 678, 200 miles an hour. Okay. I don't think, uh, hopefully, we're in the field. I guarantee you it, it would have run quicker. We're still number 11. That's where we want to be, right in the middle. Now let's just start getting these guys getting a little squirrely. Yeah. Sometimes squirrely's good though. Gotta love the squirrely. I just don't want to wreck cars or lose. Okay, we're gonna get this Wally at the finals in Pomona. Got two pit crews. <clears throat> guys here race and ghetto giving me all the support I need let's get this done did you miss us that's right folks it's the start of another NHRA typical drag racing event and we're so happy to have you here to take in the action There he goes, there he goes, there he goes, he's all, he...
Right on, buddy. <laughs> Loss of grip after that burnout attempt. Oh, there we go. We'll have to just sit and wait, boys. We've had quite a few of those tonight. Yeah, and I'm sure driving from the in car is going to be. Uh, I'm going to have a learning curve there. I haven't driven a funny car yet, and I think I've only made one, maybe two runs in a dragster. I, I'm kind of, I didn't want to jump right to the cherry on top. Figure I got to eat the whole banana split first. Start at the bottom, work your way to the top. Is what I'm saying. We're at Pro Stock now. Funny car is being built as we speak. But we've been having these AI drivers uh, seem to be taking themselves out quite frequently tonight uh, on their burnouts. Yeah. Well, my early seasons in pro mod were, were pretty uh, wild. Uh, but once we figured out a few tune-ups, we uh, we dominated. We will go back and finish. We're going to clear up, win a wally at every uh, every race, every season. It's the only thing to do in the game. It's career mode, I think. Okay, here we go. I like the look of your funny car. Yeah. And you got it. If you're addicted to this shit, your mayhem's just your middle name. Gotta love the nitro. There we go, 679. We take out uh, Erica Anders. We ended her day. 199.37. The skill these drivers have to hustle their branches down the strip, it is hard to fathom. Don't go anywhere, we've got more of it coming your way next. Okay. Semi-finals. Yeah. Yeah, they're... Uh, that's why you just have to get qualified, it seems like. And I think that's what we'll work on in Season 2 is just get the car, make sure the car's consistent and qualifying, and then just 
cut lights. Yeah, I love the flames. I think, you, you know, you should be able to, you know, the red flames is just awesome. And I like the holly, uh, the, everything just blends so well on that. semifinals season one is coming to an end we've won uh, four or five wallies now I think this will be the fifth wally of the season rookie of the rookie of the year ever since we took the the paint job to bubble gum. The car has been on a just a winning. We're gonna do well next season. Get through it onto funny car. That's where it's gonna get fun. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Full shot win right there. Wow. So we take it to the semis at the finals. To set the tone for the finals coming I just earned the uh, trophy called Well Oiled Veteran. That's my reverse burnout there. Yeah, you know, we've uh, we've had a good run with reaction time and whole shot wins. We bound to lose one. Another look at Derek Kramer's win. Ooh. It was close off the start, but he just managed to hold off his opponent to see the other side of the finish line. Okay. Well, good job, boys. We just did a full season right there. That just completed uh, the season. So we came in seventh. We did break into the thousand point. That's kind of where I was set my rookie of the year. I'm going to claim it, give it to myself. Yeah. Yeah. I wasn't expecting that. That's actually the best start. Um, first season of I'd have to look back but I, I think that is the best one uh, 
we can uh, no no ghetto the funny car is not finished and I have yet to win the championship I'm going for the goat award so you have to win a championship in every class so I think it's only gonna be two classes I'm I'm gonna say that we're gonna grab next week we'll grab uh, the second season of pro mod and uh, we'll uh, we'll be moving on uh, the funny car is just not done yet I want to take it uh, Oh, no, no, don't be sorry. Okay, ghetto, who should I pick here? We did the E3 already. Or, uh... I don't know, I think we're gonna go with Goodyear. We'll stick with them. We're gonna go over the race pack and right trailers. There we go. For aesthetics, yeah. Well, I was thinking more of a yellow car, maybe make a juicy fruit car, being that we like bubblegum. Okay, so that's good. Edelbrock, the Edelbrock group. Yeah, yeah, it's the same color. But I have these other cars that have, you know, that we have now, so we can play around with uh Let's See what we can do with this. It's that purple.
Lime candy. Don't look bad. That doesn't look half bad. We'll definitely know it's me. You know, they should just let us focus on the ass end because that's what they're all going to see. Aha. <laughs> we're going to roll with that. We're going to make some adjustments to it down the way. I don't like the gray on the bottom. Then that goes along with the bubblegum theme that we had last night. Lime boiled chocolate sweet. Sounds good. Okay. <clears throat> so now we need to find a little boys. Close. Running 200 miles an hour. We're in the 670s, but it's almost not good enough for qualifying for some of these races. We'll get season two started tonight. And then we'll just pick up again on Tuesday when I get back. where the green is okay six seventy two one ninety eight okay so that's six seventy two that's like to get in the six sixties so close Yeah. Do it. 686. Okay, I didn't like that. So, uh... Uh, actually like the uh, black and red 
go. where the gray is you did say that I, for some reason i was thinking red is, okay don't worry we'll go back we're gonna get it right we're gonna make some runs though too no 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 i'm doing this uh tonight like i said before you got on i said this is a youtube sunday night this is what you guys want you tell me to throw throw a gear at it or th you know whatever you guys want you, you know throw your tunes at it throw your uh, colors at it I think we're making it look good we're easy going here this is no uh, no stress happening see that's what I was wanting You know, you guys all week have just been chatting it up. You're only at a hundred. I feel like you're uh, you're taking uh, it easy tonight. Six eighty four, one ninety six. I take it it's race that's riding that drag bike on his YouTube channel. Race is a racer. Okay, so we're going to hit customize. We're going to go back to the accelerated green where the red is. Okay. And then he's talking about going red where the gray is. Come over here and do that. Okay. He's trying to make a piece of candy. Tea and candy on a Sunday morning. Monday morning for him. Well, see, that explains a lot with your ankle hurting. And an ice pack on it, you haven't been able to run from the uh, from the broadcast. So it's good that you have that ice pack on that ankle. It's going to keep you there. So I'm glad we could uh, keep you entertained while you're healing up. Hey, Ghetto, Race says that he's going to be running 200 miles an hour next season. Which I just find is just in the quarter mile on a bike. That's got to be a little, I don't know, big cojones. But that's our guy race. <clears throat> yeah.
yeah and hopefully you make some content uh i saw that we took your uh your count to 401 when i looked uh last night so it's good that we had some people from here uh go and uh check you out look at uh everybody you got five of you here uh race has a youtube channel uh he has uh he actually races a uh motorcycle on the quarter mile uh pushing 200 miles an hour But if you can show him some love, try to build his uh, channel up. Cool. So where do you want this? Uh, how low do you want it? Yeah, they're big ballers is what they are. So you said lower it, so I just lowered it two, two notches. You saying rear, uh, can't go back to what you were wanting. Okay, I see what you're saying. Okay. Rear spring. I okay. Frequency, yeah. Okay, so I'll put it right there. We brought it down, I think, two or three, so. Yeah, there's a, a, a dampening ratio and a uh, spring frequency. Yeah, I can't wait to get to Funny Car. That's what we're shooting for. Let's go test this thing. Yeah, I can't wait to see what the tuning screen. Um, <clears throat> maybe ghetto. Maybe you can take a screenshot and send that to me. Let me look at the parameters that you get to mess with. Yeah, no, exactly. Like I was saying, it'd be nice to change blower pulleys. You know, jet it. I'd love to have a dyno where you could dyno it and just tune your engine, you know, specifically, uh, you know, get, get deep into it. Make it like expert mode or something. Hey, we, did we put it right there? We didn't run it all the way up there, did we? Look where it's at. Uh, it was really high. I did, okay, I didn't... Uh... Oh, 
I didn't I didn't realize that. I didn't I was looking now it's uh I lost my burnout machine. Was me not having a burnout. No, we're gonna do it. We're, we're just gonna do another one. I think I can make this thing burn out. This might be the bottom of that range. The other was the top. Six ninety five, one ninety one. Yeah, it was less stable, but but you know what? We'll, we'll tweak it. We'll just we'll bring it right up into where we like it. I think it was too high. I'm glad you caught that. It's a little uh, squirrely on the low end. I don't have that like launch 760. trying to be in a burnout event. Funny. Yeah. The gassers are good. Any racing's good.
Wow. Six ninety two one ninety eight. Okay, so we've lost some of our car. Six ninety four one ninety three. Okay. Lost our mile an hour. Now we're car seems pretty stable.
just seems so wild right now. Bouncy, bumpy. Welcome viewers, we have six of you guys in here now. We're just uh, playing around with the tune-up. We're gonna start a second season. We may get Pomona done tonight before the end of the broadcast and uh, we'll be back uh, live streaming on Tuesday. I'm gonna take a couple days off. I got some things I have to take care of. Plus I've been at it uh, quite hard last few uh, weeks with the live streams. But you get three hours of drag racing every night, Tuesday through Saturday. Trying to win a uh, championship in every uh, event. Trying to get that go to ward game. Last night, with only using four gears, didn't even need the fifth gear. That wasn't uh, worthy of seeing, I guess. Sorry about the quick button kick. Let's go. I'd like to run that one again. into the track the car just said nope we're not gonna get down through here like that well, I should have wrote down that tune-up we had because <laughs> I think I've changed it <clears throat> quite a bit I have no tune written down for this we were just what we picked last night uh, and we have uh, That's a fun of tuning this thing on the fly. Being a little fickle at the moment. 
running 670s at 202. Now we're, uh... But we need more. Anybody have a suggestion? Alright, it's Sunday night. It's your guys' night to tweak the machine. Big changes in the gearing. Not close. Might as well try to bring it in. Get lucky with something. Just get out of it. 833. <clears throat> there was a pause at the start. Send that to me a couple times tonight. Lags. consistent uh So I took that up three. It's gonna make it a little more squirrelier, but if anything. Two from where we were. Maybe, maybe three down. This should make it a little more stable.
can uh, gonna take the long way to this tune-up right now. Bouncing cars off walls. And it was, it was feeling good. We're close. We're real close. I'm just going back to things that I had changed a little while ago. It does a burnout like that. We were running so good when it was just we had a good burnout car. Yeah, you're making me hungry now, buddy. was way too long. I tried to shift in there before I even left. Less tire pressure, we'll try that. We get her tuned up, we're going to Pomona, one race, and then we'll be done for the night. But I don't want to enter the car until she's ready. Wad up nice now. We're just doing this where just the five of us can see or six of us can see this happening. <laughs> Not racing. We're out testing and crashing. The tune-up has gone away. And I didn't write down that tune-up. I just I have my book here. I should have wrote it down. We won five Wallies in the first season. We're just trying to get a uh, car that's going to uh, rock the second season. We can just win the championship and move on to Funny Car. <clears throat> but normally I do a lot of this testing and crashing offline without you guys around. You know what? I think they do, but I, I have yet to... Uh, let's see... I don't know, I haven't really paid attention. I'm going back to old school where I just had stuff written down in a notebook. Once I get the chassis set up and then I'll just have a couple gear sets that work for all the tracks and we'll just go out. And... I'll be back on Tuesday. If we don't make Pomona tonight, we'll start it on Tuesday when I'm back and uh, I'll try to get 
try to get the off hour. Try to get some tunes. I'm not too worried about it. Okay. Now we have it squirrely off the line. I shipped it. I wanted to see what it run in fourth gear. I missed the shift. I was holding on there for a minute. 703, 184. Okay, so we're, I think we're close now with this. She's a little unstable at mid track. See what she does with the correct shift. we made a run down the track I'd love to see a 60 foot time 704 yeah we're still just something's just not close Sunday night test and tune with subscribers. If you like this content, please like, subscribe. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe. Turn on notice. Getting ready to hit the uh, 150 mark in chat. That's good, boys. You guys are doing well tonight. My pit crew. A705. Okay, six. Okay. We're making it. We made two slow, clean runs.
Okay. 693, 194. We're back in the sixes. We're moving in the right direction now, boys. We just might get a Pomona attempt in tonight. Yeah. You, you hear that? It was. I, it, there was a pitch in the in fifth gear there. I heard it. Alrighty, we gained a subscriber tonight. <clears throat> like it's spinning, yeah. I'd love to have a race pack like we used to have, because then you could you could just see where it's not wanting to be. And we're guessing without incremental times. There's timing blocks out there, but they're not giving us any time. They're all there just for looks. That's what drag racing is, is keeping track of numbers and times. That was a much better run right there. Wow. So they do have sleep socks. Okay. Where's ghetto at? Let's see. So it's Longer first gear, yeah. It's spinning, it's going red in first. Let's see how that does. Croissants sound good. There should be orange blocks flying over the windshield. Good for you, ghetto. Now, what kind of tea do you drink? Is there a, like a, you know, is it... I'm not a tea drinker, but I'm sure there's different flavors of tea.
feel like I, I have to drive this car more than I ever have. Those top fuel Harleys are, are just insane. Absolutely insane. And they're big heavy bikes compared to what you're riding race. Yeah. Actually, I forgot we changed the tire pressure. I didn't know if tea was like mine or like a designer tea. I'm going to do something. Because I feel like we're uh, kind of lost. So now on this ghetto, because I haven't done it, where it says load tuning profile. So if I go there, it just has one. Uh, where do I save to where I save multiple tunes? The in crowd, yeah. Definitely not the in crowd here. Not with the names like Ghetto and Alki. Put the two of us together and we make a neighborhood. Okay, create. Oh, so that's it. So that's saving that tune up right there that we have. Okay. Now, do they allow you to name them so you know what they are? Or is it just going to say tuning profile two and I'm going to have to remember what that is? But you can't custom name them like say this is a, you know, this works here. This is a, uh, you know, a 660 tune-up. No name. So what a shame. They should be able to let you just kind of make a little note, mental note, so I can go and go, oh, I want that 660 tune. I want the, you know, this is my qualifying tune. Yeah, it's the little things. It's like... They got some of it just so correct, and then they, it's like they're, they got lazy in, in a lot of areas. Because I haven't never discovered this, and I'd love to just save these tunes right here. But what's, let's say I get a whole handful of tunes here for Pro Stock, I'm not going to know what's what. I, my book might as well be better, because I have notes with my books. Yeah, 100% correct. They released it way too early. 
we just chased away a cook. <laughs> It's all we got. It's all we got, Ghetto. You're 100% correct. Bring me back to center. Uh, I just see, you know, it'd be, I'd never have seen this where you can save a tune. Um, problem is, you just don't know what tune up you're saving. So, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, reset this tune up. We know pretty much the basics where we're going to want some stuff. I'm going to leave that high there. Do a little bitching, but I'm still gonna play the game. The game's still playable. Okay. Sometimes you gotta take two steps back to go forward. Yeah. See, I'd never played that game. So, uh, look at that. We run 680, 193. So, we got ourselves all discombobulated. Yeah, we just ran a 680. We just, uh, I reset the tune back to the, the starting tune up. We had gotten so far off. Yeah, I'd like to get a full driving setup. Well, there's three of you guys in here. We just ran 680. I'm almost willing to go and enter Pomona and just see how we do. Get the next season started and then finish the stream. Or you know what? I see that we're at the three hour mark. Guys, uh, I'd love to hang out. You want to do it? Okay, let's do it. You changed my mind real easily. There's part of me that wants to keep going and then, uh, but I think, I think cars back to being close. Let's get the second season started. Okay, so we still have a little testing to do, tweaking. Yep. Oh, we'll be qualifying. I think we'll do a test pass just because it's the start of the season. Oh! <laughs> yep. Yep, that's it. We, I, I had said that we'd do Pavona. And I'll tell you what, I do like that red. That red it was a, a good trick, so it was the lime green. Black's always good. I like wearing black. Let's go do this. The NHRA, that's the National Auto Association, is the largest auto racing sanctioned body in the world. There are over 35,000 licensed competitors. Oh, there we go. Sideways. He's sideways. 
Whoa, he hit that. Oh my god. There might be somebody killed. Blue screen just for a clip. Wow, he had a throttle stuck. Yeah, I think so. I'll tell you what. Poor guy. That's like the fourth or fifth time that's happened tonight. And I'm not going to be able to do a... Uh... Not going to let me do it. Watching the last time it did that, it gave me a 760 ET. He heard croissants were ready. <laughs> Had to turn around and go back. Look, we ran a 657 in a test pass. Quickest ever I've ever run. Hopefully, that's the tune up that's in it. Yeah, I got a career best, guys. Champion here. And there, and all three of you guys got to see it. I feel like I'm a magnet to some of these little clips. And it, it must be the, the amount of time I'm playing. But I've had some funny stuff happen. Yeah, that is a sharp looking car. We're scaring them. You know what's so funny is we're we're deeply qualified and we haven't even made a run. The Pro Stock category began in 1970 and it's notable for their engine not having any supercharger or turbocharger attached. Six eighty eight. Oh, look at that double oh one. Oh, I think I'm losing my voice. What a race we just saw, and we've got more NH. Oh. Okay. Have we decent pole point run? Enough to beat their opponent in this match and move them on to the next round. 
I don't know for. Oh, there's a career best right there. Six sixty two. One ninety one. Yeah. Wow, that was something special, wasn't it? Two of the NHRA's brightest stars head to head, and there's plenty more of that to come next. Yeah, I can tell you the truth, it never felt like it. That's it, it's odd how some of these runs you feel like you really did something and it's nothing. But that's drag racing, I guess. Yeah. Well, no, actually, that was our test run. It wasn't our qualifying. So that happened in our test run. I was... Uh, I thought it was qualifying, but I forgot we did the test run. So that was where that glitch time was. Just a reminder that the NHRA offers every single ticket holder an open access to the pit area. So if you haven't had the chance yet, go take a peek at what this is. There we go. I had to party with him, you know? <laughs> I'm not used to being outside the car when I'm driving it. I'm going to tell you what, that it, it, it's getting comical with these guys crashing like that. Uh, absolutely comical. If you can't beat them, join them. Okay, sorry about that. Now let's hope they don't DQ my previous two runs because I crashed my car, remember? They did that once tonight already too. Yeah. Well, I wanted to get some good footage of him coming into my lane like that. That's a... Uh, pretty funny welcome viewers got a couple new viewers here we're taking this deep into th over three hours we'll see where we go tonight give a second when we just might continue on okay let's uh, fix this thing Oh, we got it going again. That is something. Oh, we have stuff flying at us. Oh, he's having a hard time. I hope he's okay. I really hope. Oh, he's. Oh, this guy. Let's go. We're going to have to go help him. Is he okay? He's having, maybe he had a heart attack or maybe he's a diabetic. I don't know. By one of our competitors. That's a DQ. Wow. Way to start season two. Yeah, he's Kato. He knocked himself out is all I can figure. And I'm going to tell you what, this is getting dangerous for the AIs in this game. Comical. <laughs> Blue screen again.
Hey, we're making good content. Okay, so we DQ twice. Can't beat them, join them. We already know that they're not going to let us make a run when they do that, so you might as well go out and bang up your car with them. Let's have some fun here. Yeah, your croissants, man. We're, uh, it, it's something. I'm, I'm really, I have yet to see anything like this in any of my streams. And we've had it happen. Wow. I want to say six times at least. Okay, we're, we, at least we're qualified. Hey, now let's have it happen in illuminations. We'll just get by runs. Well, it looks like I'm racing a teammate sponsored by Goodyear also. I say my car looks better. It's race day here at the Fairplex, also known as Auto Club Raceway. The drivers and the crews are getting ready down in the pits for a great day of NHR reaction. was a uh, back to a thumb not even on the steering wheel the steering wheel was just go baby just hook and book a whole shot win 689 what he's showing from these two drivers I don't know about you folks but I am still coming down from that one Yeah. Okay. hit 288 chat that's looking pretty impressive This weekend race fans, you can get a chance to run into some of your favorite drivers right down in the midway. Do not be shy. They love taking photos and giving on Yeah. Okay, here we go. Let's starting line I sat there for a minute with the 
didn't move anything, so really don't know. Yeah, okay. Whole shot win. 685 beats a 677. We get a lot of whole shots here. The skill these drivers have to hustle their dragsters down the strip, it is hard to fathom. Don't go anywhere. We okay, we're in the semis at Pomona. Winter Nationals. First race of the second season. <laughs> That's what she said. Uh. Finals, we gotta take on the girl. The NHRA. That's Let's go get her. Is the largest auto racing sanctioned body. There are over 35,000 licensed executives. Oh! Your poor Erica! Oh, she's. Oh, she's having a tough time, guys. She's having a real tough time out there. Oh no. Yeah, she's having a tough time. Oh, well, poor girl. Did the driver in the right lane hold their brakes well enough with that burnout? She's ready to race. Look at that. That is how good she staged. That is how good she is. Oh, let's go, Erica. Just hold on, hold on. We're gonna get into the staging lanes. Or in the beams, let's go. Oh, in her car, she just... The greatest drag race I've had all night. I lose to a girl who bangs it all out there. They better give me the win just for her. Yeah, yeah. The the content that's just being made here is amazing. But they're not giving me the win, if you notice. And she smoked me. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I think they're going to DQ me. For getting camera angles, I'm a witness to a flawed game. Yeah. Yeah, I... I lose winning my first race in the second season. I want to talk to an official. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm a little perturbed. How am I to be the GOAT, win all these races, and I legitly did not do anything wrong, did I? Wow. But I'll tell you what. You can like and subscribe if you like the content. If you're watching this, um, it gets fun. That I'll tell you what, that's amazing. She crashes and I get DQ'd uh, for making a run. Uh, I should be in the finals. I should be the winner because I was going to beat Troy Coughlin. It's just a given. Put us two together, I'm going to beat him. But I don't know. That's a major glitch. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. She's, I don't know. It, it, it appears somebody can be bought and change the results because uh, I should have won. I should have won that race. <laughs> yeah.
that's amazing we're gonna make a video with this one boys look forward to it like and subscribe if you like the content you guys have been savages tonight uh, 299 I'm sure it's gonna go up over 300 chat you can catch this content Tuesday through Saturday we start at 8 o'clock on uh, Pacific Standard Time uh, I appreciate all the uh, new subscribers you guys are wonderful uh, thank you for watching and uh, we'll see you soon absolutely amazing